Yeah, the village people won't really talk to you. <laughs> hey, ew! How'd you get here? Never mind that. I guess it's fate that brought us together. Get ready to die. Elena, you talk too much. What? We, what are we what are we doing way out here in the middle of nowhere? We're taking our vacation and resting up from our work. Now our vacation is ruined. But even the booze tastes bad now. Sorry. Drink, Rude. How long have we been a team? There have been hard times being Turk, but all in all, I'm glad I did it. I even got to meet a bunch of wingnuts like you. Yeah, if you talk to that guy right there and you read all the Turtles Paradise flyers, then yeah, you get a special item. Hmm, you're lucky, all right. Now get out of my sight. The next time we meet, I won't be so nice. To the Turks. To Reno. Cheers. like the one from a while ago, but these ones look weird too. Oh, how exciting! You a friend of my grandson's? No, Gramps, these guys are creepy. They're running all over the place. Life is just like the flowing of a river. It flows from the large ocean of life and eventually it returns back to it. Wutai is a historical place. There are some very unusual things here you should see. Lord Godo. I don't know if it's pronounced Godo or Gado. I say Gado. He is in this house. He used to be quite strong, but now all he does is sleep. That reminds me. Lately I've been seeing a kid running around here that reminds me of Yuffie. Always sneaking around corners and into something she shouldn't be. much, but you should be able to ugh, rest yourselves here. Ugh, make yourselves at home. I'm like stepping on it. <laughs> Yuffie? Nope, never heard of her. Ugh. You again. I told you once and I'm telling you again. I don't know her. Listen, I said I didn't know her. There isn't anyone named Yuffie here in Wutai. Never seen you around here before. Lately I've been seeing a lot of Shinra soldiers around here. You wouldn't have anything to do with that, would you? I don't care about who you are. But if you're in trouble with the Shinra, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. I don't want the Shinra hanging around here looking over my shoulder. What's with you, you coward? Yuffie! 
You scared of the Shinra? Then why don't you fall into line and obey them, just like all of the other towns? Those guys are the ones who are really fighting the Shinra. Shut up. What would you know about this? You get beaten once and then that's it? What happened to the mighty Wutai I used to know? No kid like you is going to talk to me like that. You keep acting like that, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. That's my style, and it's my own business, not yours. Don't you try and dictate what I should do. Style? Dictate? Throwing around all those fancy words. You're a miserable daughter. Huh. You're a sad excuse for a father. <laughs> Take your things and get out of here now. To protect Wu Tai, we cannot afford to stand up to Shinra. That five story pagoda over there is called the Pagoda of the Five Mighty Gods. The five gods are power, speed, magic, war, and omni, who has the best characteristics of everything. Since ancient times, we in Wu Tai have worshipped Daichi. The Cheo and the Water God. Legend has it that the village has been protected by the Cheo, the Water God, and the Five Mighty Gods. But in the last battle, we didn't fare so well. I guess our beliefs were based on nothing more than legends. Get away, Yuffie. Oh, okay, I know. I was wrong. You win. I'll give you back your materia. So our reports were right. He is here on vacation. We finally found him. Get the Turks here for backup. What a drag. What was that? Right now we're off duty and can't run and can't run off to save your butts. We know you're off duty, but if you knew that, then don't bother us. Looking at you is making me sober. But you all have orders from headquarters to look for, for him too. All right, that's it. We'll get him without any help from the Turks. Just you see. And don't think that headquarters isn't going to hear about this. Reno, do you think that was really such a good idea? I mean, is that the way a professional, a Turk, would act? Elena, I don't misunderstand. A pro isn't someone who sacrifices himself for his job. That's just a fool. Rude? Well, I don't buy that. Goodbye. Relax, she's not a child. Let her have her way now. I know. The materia, right? I have it stored in a safe place. Follow me. I've been hearing that ever since I was little. Before I was born. Wutai was a lot more crowded and more important. You saw what it looks like now, right? Just a resort town. After we lost the war, we got peace. But with that, we lost something else. Now look at Wutai. That's why, if I had a lot of materia, I could... Listen, Yuffie, I don't care about the history of Wutai or your feelings. You've got our materia, and I want it back. Now. If you give it back now, we'll drop the whole thing. I know. I know that. That switch, the lever on the left, Materia. <laughs> In there. Mm, I don't know. There was nothing else to do. What? 
Never trust anyone that easily. The material is mine. Tough. You want your materia? Then go find it yourself. Yeah, that's right. And when you're looking for the materia, remember, you gotta steal it. <laughs> steal! Steal! Get it? Yeah. Jerk! You! Ho! Ho! Corneo! I finally got a new chicky! Two for one, in fact! Two! Hey! Let go of me! You're gonna regret this! There he is. It's Corneo. Don't let him get away. Attack! Okay, here is Vincent's first limit break, Galleon Beast. He only has four limit breaks. Ah, you have oh there we go. Go Vincent. That'll kill him. Oh yeah. Good at escaping. Elena. Let's go, Rude. We'll give them a taste of what the Turks can do. Sounded pretty good. If Elena is in his hands, that's gonna make things a little difficult. And, uh. Okay, Corneo took Yuffie from us. And without Yuffie, there's no way we'll get our materia back. Don't misunderstand. We have no intention of joining you. But for now, we'll agree not to bother each other. That's all. That's fine. We have absolutely no intention of cooperating with the Turks, either. Now, uh, just what direction did Corneo run off to? Ah, nice attitude. Here's a clue. It's the place that stands out the most. Okay, I definitely gotta get myself healed up and stuff, because this next boss battle is really, really hard. All right, all right, all right, I know. On the side of the mountain right there in your face is the chail. I hear you can climb to the top, but since it's dangerous, I'd be mighty careful if I were you. All right, all right, all right, I saw an old man in flashy clothes running towards the chail. He was babbling something and looked like he could float. It almost bowled me over. Okay. You're finally here. We're gonna split into two. You do whatever you want, but don't endanger Elena. Don't worry, we won't do anything to that girl Yuffie. For now. <laughs>